Hello, this is super cool. Time for another super cool review. Guess what? We're still in Star Wars prequel month. I just saw a film that scarred me for life. Okay, it really didn't scar me, but it just makes my voice sound so deep. Good God, I saw it. That's really because I couldn't think of any Star Wars prequel to think of. This is a little film that's so oh, bad that other people like it. It's called Star Wars The Clone Wars. Yeah, I know people like this film. Yeah, I think I know it did well in box office. Yeah, I think I know critics and audiences like it. Yeah, I know it made little kids happy, but you don't know any better, okay, people? You don't, you, you don't, you, okay, look. It's not well acted. It's not well written. It's not well, okay? All right, let's jump to the stories. Or Java Sun. Yeah, you never know that job of the Hutt actually had a son, but I'll get to that. But we don't want to hear about it again. Gets kidnapped by Count Dooku, played once again by Christopher Lee. And that's up to Republic, played once again by... I mean, Anakin. This time, I played by Hayden Christensen, but a much more hated Hayden Christensen. With along with Master Obi-Wan Kenobi, played by James Arnold Taylor. And a new character, Ahsoka Tano, played by Tara Strong. All the clones, they must find Java san before Count Dooku does more political talk that's in the other films. Yeah, I'm sorry, people. It's just so terrible. It's just one word. Boring. It is long. It's not interesting to look at. It's not interesting to see. It's the most forgettable of them all. In fact, even got a TV show, but I'm not reviewing that. I mean, it's not good much pilots to TV shows for movies. Yeah, I'm not I mean, it, I'm not sure I know people like the Clone Wars show, but to be fair, I did not watch the show. I mean, we've seen other good action series before that show. I mean, Samurai Jack, Dragon Ball Z, Naruto, and yeah, that's pretty much all I know. Oh, and yeah, it's still Finding Nemo concept. Finding a son and running to people, then finding the son again. And then capturing the sun, and yeah, it's just so dull. And the talk is just so boring. People may disagree with me on this. Because I don't think the actor or Anakin this movie does a good performance. You heard right. I don't think the actor for Anakin this movie does a good performance. I mean, yeah, we all hate Hayden Christensen, but his, his voice is just so low like mine now. Oh, and it's just so dull. The only actor they got from the original movies was Christopher Lee. Really, was it even worth getting him? It's like making a mask three and the only cast member you got was one of the gang members from the Tommy Gun scene. Well, to be fair, that gang member would get a lot of fan base afterwards. Anyway, Rain Star Wars the Clone Wars movie. 51 lightsaber battle on pointless fight scenes out of a hundred. Tune in next week where I have to review the final one. Thank God. No!